Got the pure monies. Pure money. I'm going to show y'all where all those bags come from, guys. These are a bunch of eggs. Now, I'm going to get into the other books. This is Fern Small and the Big. Little Joker, Big. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to the life of Emmy. And guys, I am kind of sad right now, man. I messed up so bad, man. If you guys watch my video, I just dropped it today. You guys are going to see this tomorrow, so make sure you go back and watch it. It's only a five-minute video. I had a 45-minute video ready to go, ready to upload. Long story, short story, I had to delete some memory to upload it because it said I didn't have enough memory to, so it can upload. I went ahead because I don't know how to work Samsung, which I record off of Samsung. I went ahead and deleted videos off my gallery, not knowing I deleted the video that I was, the, all the little videos that I merged together and edited for like three hours to finally upload it. And I went to the trash after I deleted it off the gallery. I didn't know I was deleted those videos. I just, I don't know. Deleted the trash, deleted the videos. I went to go upload it to YouTube and it said media now found because I deleted the videos that I was uploading. Oh my God, guys. But anyways, I'm gonna make up for it, guys. Stay tuned. This video is gonna be really, really, really good. Stay tuned. I'm gonna show you guys my exclusive collections at my house. I got a bunch of stuff that I've been collecting for a long time, uh, and I'm gonna show you five collections. Five collections, guys. I'm not gonna tell you right now what they are, but please, please stay tuned. It'll make me feel good because I was gonna, I was supposed to upload today. I already had a thumbnail for it. It's just stupid, man. It's stupid, it's stupid, and it's stupid. I don't know how I made a huge mistake like that. Um, I definitely learned from it. Like I said, guys, I'm literally practicing as I'm, as I'm doing this, uh, vlogging on YouTube. Literally practicing every day, living and learning every day. Oh, guys, I'm still bothered. Like, I started sweating earlier. When I noticed, when I noticed what I did, what was that? Okay. When I noticed what I did, guys, I almost fell out. I was so pissed. I called my boy Davey about it. I'm like, bro, I messed up so bad, man. He was like, got him. He was laughing at me and stuff. But anyways, guys, I'm going to be back. Trust me. Stay tuned, guys. You guys want to see my collection. It's a lot of cool things I'm going to be showing you guys that I have to redo. I, I did a, such a cool setup last night because I had no content just for me to delete it today. It's just crazy. I'll be redoing it. I'll see y'all in three, two, one. All right, guys, we are almost out of here. Almost out of here. And I wanted to say to stay tuned. I'm coming with some stuff that's, you know, a little exciting. I'm gonna show y'all my collections. You get what I'm saying? But I do want y'all to know, I also got a Terrapedic at the house. This right here is my favorite Terrapedic. It's called the Pro Breeze it's a medium hybrid. I'm gonna grab it soon, one day, soon. I've been waiting to get, I go home, there's a lot of stuff I wanna do that I'm saving up for so that when I get to home, I can just do my thing and live how I wanna live. But All right guys, I am out and I am out. Look, I'm about to go home and recreate the content that I made last night and I actually deleted, guys. That's. That's just so mind blowing to me, man. I don't know how I did that. Uh, I was just talking to CJ about it. He said he did something like that before too. So I guess I ain't the only one in my man's uh, TNT life. It's a couple challenge that follows me. Uh, shout out to them. He said he did it before too. I'm like, dang, man, made me so freaking mad, guys. I swear, made me so freaking mad. But I'm gonna uh, recreate it right now. I ain't got nothing else to do. I'm off tomorrow, I'm off Friday. I got a haircut at eight in the morning, so man, I'm gonna be up. I'm gonna be up. Uh, uh, y'all already know what time it is, though, right? <clears throat> if y'all new to the channel, subscribe, subscribe, like, and y'all should know that I always keep the top down. I swear, in the winter, I'm probably gonna have the top down too. <laughs> I'm gonna show y'all how my uh, headrest got the neck, got the heaters. I don't know if y'all see it. It got heaters, but. Look, man, I'm going to see y'all in a bit. I hope all is well. I'm actually going to grab something to eat, too. I'm hungry as heck. I hope y'all having a great Thursday because I'm dropping this on Thursday. Don't let nobody, I'm talking about nobody, bring y'all down. 
and uh, make sure y'all have a wonderful rest of the day. But meanwhile, stay tuned, guys. Stay tuned because I am coming with some stuff. Y'all can comment, like, tell me if y'all like my stuff or not. But I'm going to just go ahead and show y'all my whole collection, a bunch of stuff that I collect. Damn, I'm so bogus, y'all. One day I'm going to grow right here. I'm bald right there. One day it's going to grow. One day it's going to grow. But I'm going to be back, guys, in a couple seconds. All right, y'all. I told y'all. I told y'all I'm going to redo what I did last night, but I'm going to do even better. Because I was rushing it last night. I got time today. I'm off tomorrow. Remember, guys, happy Thursday. I told y'all to stay tuned. I'm about to show y'all five collections. Five. One collection is going to be watches. One collection is going to be shoes. One collection is going to be hats. One collection is going to be colognes. Another collection, my fifth collection is going to be books. Yes. I have read books. I haven't read books in a little while, but I used to love reading books. I need to go back to reading books, and I'm going to show you all my collection of books. But meanwhile, we're going to go nice and spicy with it and show you all my watch collection. I got to watch for every day, and, you know, got to show you all, man. You work hard. You can get these type of things. <clears throat> I get a watch for every year that I've been, in my eyes, successful since I started Ashley Furniture. I've been making uh, making some decent money. So, let me show y'all what happens when you work hard. Show y'all the first one. It's a bold Avado, right? Let me show you. So this is my first watch I ever bought. Shout out to my boy, Marna Yala. Uh, I bought it from him when he worked at Jared. So that's a good watch. There's a Belova. I got this watch given to me. I hardly ever wear it. But I still keep it because it's decent. It's a nice little nice little watch. Would never wear it anymore, though. And then I'm going to show y'all the exclusive that nobody that you know got. Though nobody got this. Nobody. Tell me who got that. Not trying to be cocky. But, hey, don't nobody got that. That's that bold Movado smartwatch. Then we're going to go right with the classic gold with silver. Gold with silver. It is really nice and you gotta do the all blacks you know this is the all black right there y'all that motherfucker nice i wear that today then you got the all silver that's the classic that's a classic i know y'all see the movado boxes yes sir i'm gonna move on to the gucci see i just had to throw the the wallet the wallet in there you get what i'm saying got that gucci rag this one gonna be a little hard for me to get second y'all one second because it's kind of hidden. This is my favorite one. Where this one right here. This one glows in the dark, guys. So you see the, the cat and all that white. Uh, all this right here. It glows green in the dark. It is nasty. It's got the Gucci on the band. Gucci on there. It go with my Gucci glasses. I'm going to show you all something real quick. My Gucci glasses got the gold. Yeah, these are, this, I don't know if y'all can see it. Yeah, Gucci. So, I had to get that. I had to get the gold accents. That is my watches. I had to go straight in. Uh, yesterday, I started with something else, but I wanted to go straight in with the watches so y'all could see my collection. Tell me which one you would y'all have. Which one do you guys have already? Do you guys like Movado? Uh, do you guys like Belova? Do you guys like Gucci? What do y'all have? You get what I'm saying? Or which one would you like to wear? You get what I'm saying? So, um... Let me know, guys. Comment down below. Make sure you like and comment and subscribe, guys. Whoever's not subscribing, watching this, please, 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 from the bottom of my heart, press that subscribe button. And then you see the bell to the right. Click the bell button. that go ding, 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 and put on all post notifications, guys. I truly appreciate y'all. I'm going to move on to my next collection. I'll be back in a couple seconds. Y'all know I'll be back in when? One, two, All right, guys, I'm back. And now it's time for my second collection. My second collection going to be my colognes. Stay tuned, guys. Stay tuned. Do not leave the video yet. What you up to anyways, right? Why not just watch what Martin talking about? Appreciate y'all for staying. I'm not making y'all stay. Y'all can leave if y'all want. 
but I really appreciate it. Got a lot of stuff to show y'all. So let me show y'all the colognes. We're gonna start with the Gucci Guilty. We got the small and the big. Little Joker, big Joker. Only the real ones know what that means. This cologne right here is fa. This one is even better. Y'all see that blue in there? Ooh, that's nasty. I know how to say the box. We got the polo blue. This is shout out to my mom's step. Oh my god, my mom's to my stepdad Jose. Shout out to Jose. Thank you. He always gave me some good stuff. That's called Mont Black. I think that's from uh, Express. I believe that's really good. Eternity's good, and Dolce Gabbana. Y'all see that's already gone. That is the colognes. Which one would y'all take, or which one do y'all have already? Now, don't mention Savage. Everybody got Savage. I got Savage, I think it was the first week it came out, because I happened to just be there, and it was like, this just came out like last week. Maybe they sold me. I don't know, but I do know all of a sudden when I grabbed it, everybody's, what's that? What's that? I had my customers, oh my God, what is that? I want to get that for my husband. And then all of a sudden, everybody got Savage now. Savage is played out to me, personally. It's time to move your game up. And get you this Benz cologne. This Benz cologne is five. Plus, I got a Benz, so y'all know. Y'all know. Okay. But which one would y'all take? Or which one do y'all already have? Comment below. Let me know what y'all think about my cologne collection. Okay? Tell me if I should buy another cologne. Tell me what cologne y'all think I should grab. I don't know. But these are colognes I got right now. Don't say Savage because I already had, I think, two bottles of Savage before. I'm going to be back. That was my cologne collection, guys. Time to show y'all another collection. Number three is coming right up. I don't know which one. Let me figure it out. I'll see y'all in a bit. All right, guys. <clears throat> Man. Had to do a lot of moving around. Um, like I said, I want to make it better this time. Since I got my video deleted that I was supposed to drop today in my collections, I want to make it better. So I made it better. I'm going to be showing, I think, a six collection, guys. I think I'm going to be showing a six collection. But for meanwhile, let's get to my hats. So I showed the watches, right? I showed the colognes, and now I'm going to the hats, all right? I don't even wear hats no more. But I want y'all to see something, guys. See something. What's my channel called? Life of who? Life of who? M.E., guys. I've been representing M.E. since I was a short. I've been representing Esparza even longer than that. Esparza's always been a really, really cool name. And, guys, M.E. stands for Martin Esparza, right? I have a sister named Marcella Esparza. I have a cousin named Myra Esparza. I have an uncle named Martin Esparza. I have another cousin named Martin Esparza. I have a cousin, another cousin named Martin Esparza. I got a cousin who lives in Florida named Martin Esparza. Cousin Oklahoma named Martin Esparza. My uncle named Martin Esparza. Uh, my tia Malena Esparza. My uncle Manuel Esparza. We all come, the Martins at least, there's three of us. We call each other M.E. Gain. All of us call each other M.E. Gain. I, I made it up from a youngin. Call us M.E. Gain because M.E. People used to ask me, what you claim, bro? I used to be like, M.E. They're like, what's that? Martin Esparza. Oh, who's that? Me. Oh, man, I respect. I've never claimed the game, guys. If y'all want to claim a game, then y'all tweaking. Claim yourself. Represent yourself. I've been and me all my life. I'm telling y'all, be yourselves. It makes you survive longer. People respect you more. You ain't got to worry about no petty stuff. You can be neutral and be cool with everybody. So, with that being said, uh, I'm going to go ahead and show y'all the rest of the hat. And I got to start with the spars. My dad gave me this hat. Y'all know, this is that Mexicano hat right here, y'all. You get what I'm saying? Look, this is a Mexicano hat. This is that low-key hat. Y'all ain't gonna see me when I pull up. You get what I'm saying? Low so then, y'all know I got the XO. Oh my gosh. I used to wear our cats every time. This is a Beauty Behind the Madness hat. Nasty. This is the... I think this is just... I think this was the King of the Fall hat. Or I think it was the Private Event hat. I'm not sure, but it's nasty. This is the official issue. When it, we used to be called official issue. All tagged out Kissland hat as y'all see I don't know what happened down there Kissland I think it looks cool on the inside oh yeah looks super dope on the inside this is the Thursday hat this is the Thursday hat 
I believe, or is it the House of Balloons? I don't remember. But nasty. This guy, I don't know what happened. Look at the white. The white's gone. Whew. But nasty. I don't know what happened to this, guys. I must have been... I don't know. I must have gotten some type of fight. Some type of blood was on this. I don't know. But this is your Echoes of Silence hat right there. Nasty. Y'all know I got the beanie, by the way. I got like four other beanies. Give me my beanies back, y'all. Y'all know who you are. If you're watching this, give me my beanies back. Y'all know I got the XO. White version. Black version. Y'all know I'm going to have the Martin hat. After Hours hat. Anna Leno. I'm going to get to Anna Leno right now. <coughs> my second favorite NBA team. And then my first. This is my number one favorite NBA team. Look, guys. I'm about to show y'all. My sixth collection is going to have something to do with the XO and the OKC. I got some other stuff that I've collected, I guess, for a while. Um, definitely going to show y'all all my XO stuff. I got a lot of XO stuff. Um, let's get back to that Anna Leno hat. Anna Leno, I met her. She opened up for the weekend two times at the Kissland tour, just to make it short for y'all. She told me to meet her at the merch uh, shop after the shows both days, took a picture with her, and then one day she was at uh, Lollapalooza, and I couldn't make it, tweeted her, like, I wish I could see you. She DM'd me and gave me an artist pass for Sunday, which is the day she was performing, and I was able to go. Shout out to KJ, because KJ went as well, but he didn't get an artist pass. He was just already going by himself. I got an artist pass. Artist Pass lets you get behind those stages. Y'all know those stages at Lollapalooza? There's food, artists, tents, and stuff back there. I got to see Chance the Rapper, Janae Aiko. Uh, you know, I didn't go up to them or nothing. But I got to see them chilling outside their little patio thing, outside their tent, before they came out and performed. But the best part was the food, y'all. That food was fire, and it was free-free. But shout out to Anna Leno. She ain't gonna watch this, but she showed me so much love. Guys, that's when I used to work at Comcast about like eight years ago. And she gave me an artist pass at Will Call for free. Just because she remembered who I was when we took them pictures. And we were always talking on Facebook. I actually should DM her again to see how she's been. She's super famous from Australia. She became even more famous now. But are my hats. Those are my hats. I haven't worn hats in forever. I used to have them and I sold them all. Tell me what y'all think, man. But this one. This that M.E. life right there. Life of M.E., guys. I've been representing Mars Sparza for a long, long time. Don't leave, guys. Don't. Born or not, but I don't care, y'all. I'm going to show y'all the collections of Martin Sparza, All the stuff that I have worked hard for and spent some hard work and money on. I don't know what the next collection on, but stay tuned, guys. It's coming right. I told y'all I'll be right up. I'm here. I'm here. Look. I am now going to show y'all the fourth collection, all right? Tell me what y'all think, man. I got some books. I used to read books a lot. I need to go back to reading books. I want to show y'all the books that I got. People out there that are not reading books, make sure you start reading books. They keep your mind running. I need to start reading books, guys. My mind is not running no more. I need to figure it out. So I think the books is the solution. This might be my way to start reading books again. But I do want to show y'all the books that I have have first we're gonna start with my phone this is called you're a badass i read that book like three times such a great book it's in, written by jen sincero and however you say it and it's a perspective of a woman guys you need to read that how to stop debating your greatness and start living an awesome life these are facts i read that book like three times and then you got i can't make this up Let's go back to, I don't know what just happened. Hold on, y'all. Stay with me. I don't know what just happened. Oh, there we go. All right, so this is the Kevin Hart book. I read this like two times. Uh, I think I was reading it for a third time, so it says 71%. This is a really good book called Now Discover Your Strengths. This is for people that want to be managers or leaders in this world that discover... There's, you know, let's say there's a, a weak salesperson. I believe everybody's a, a good salesperson. You just need to help them become one. Let's say you, somebody has all these weaknesses, right? It's your job to find the strengths in those weaknesses. That's all I got to say. That book is going to explain the... Now, The Kite Runner, I ain't going to lie to y'all. I'm actually at 21% on that. I cannot really get into it, 
but I heard it's a really good book. Now, I'm going to get into the other books. This is Furniture is My Passion. Y'all know I work at Ashley Furniture. I need to start reading this, too, just to see what's up. A bunch of cool stuff in here, probably, or some cool history. I don't know. This is not a book, but my sister, Marcella, graduated from University of Oklahoma, and her name's in there, so I'm always going to keep that. That is an amazing thing to keep, memories. Think and Grow Rich. I bought this and still haven't read it, y'all. I am tweaking. Oh, y'all know I need Jesus. Oh, my God, y'all know I need Jesus. So, here's the Holy Bible. Make sure y'all always have a Holy Bible. I think I read this once when I was, like, younger. I still got it with me. Here's another thing. I think this is, like, I don't know. I don't know what. The, I think this is, like, a, oh, look at that, y'all. Hey, that's y'all. That's your boy. What was I on? Who did I think I was? On, on your graduation from your lunch lady. Oh, my lunch lady was nice. She's nice as heck for that. But anyways, I think this is like another story of the Bible. Y'all know there's like trillion stories, Bibles out there. Look at this old dictionary. I need to start reading this dictionary so I can get my vocabulary back up. Best known as Shorty. This is when we used to say best known as. But now they just say AKA. And y'all know it got Martin Esparza. Martin Esparza. Always represented in me. And I used to call myself Shorty. I'm still Shorty. Low key because I'm short. But I embrace it and I love it. These are books by Gary R. Smith. These are Wobbles. The guy I always uh, promote. His real name is Ronil Smith. And these are his dad's books. And I read this one I believe. Or this one. I remember. One of these I didn't read. And they are great books. I'm going to finish the second one. Don't kill me Ron. Boundaries for Leaders. I went to Barnes & Noble personally for this book. And I still haven't read it. But I'm going to read it one day. And then Beyond Me, starring Ha Ha Davis. Y'all Y'all gotta mess with Ha Ha Davis. Y'all don't follow him on social media. Y'all are tweaking. That dude laugh every day. He's just so hilarious, guys. But those are my books. That's my book collection. Let me know what y'all think. Let me know if y'all got some of these books. Let me know if y'all want some of these books. Let me know if y'all interested in these books. I don't know. We can go shopping together for books. You never know. I need to start reading books. We can be book partners, book buddies, you know what I'm saying, and read books together. But those are my books. I'm coming right up with the other collection, guys. It's coming right up. It's coming right up. Give me a couple seconds. Tell me what y'all think. Make sure you like and comment. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. Subscribe to the kid. Subscribe to the kid. I'm going to continue bringing content every day. I have not missed. Since I started YouTube, guys, I have not missed. I drop every day. Every day. All right? I'll be right back. All right, guys. I'm working really hard. I ain't going to lie to y'all. I'm working really, really hard for all this. But with the bags, I'm going to show y'all all the exterior. Look at all those bags. I'm going to show y'all where all those bags come from, guys. These are a bunch of XO bags. These are all VIP bags here. All VIP bags for all his shows. Right here, I got all the uh, tickets. The original tickets still in there. This, I've never even taken off. This still actually... Like I said, man, when I get it home, I'm going to put all this there. Got the Kissland vinyl. Got a bunch of posters. These three right here are going to dark posters. I still haven't ever opened them. Got some exclusive posters in there. Uh, this one is really good. This one's really good. Man, this poster can't even roll that one up. Roll that. This one is cool. This is when the weekend invited us to his private event, and he put his name. He shook all of our hands, and then put our names on there. So that was cool. Um, hand signed, original. This is original, original guys. Like I bought it on the same day that trilogy came out. Kept it in my room. Luckily, I didn't get robbed when somebody robbed my car one time. Uh, and they took the signed trilogy and the signed Kiss Land. But these are all the albums in order for y'all. We got Trilogy. We got Kiss Land, Beauty Behind a Madness, Starboy, My Dear Malacorni. That everybody sleeps on. That thing is fire. This is After Hours and then the extended After Hours. Y'all know I got the clock. And then boom. Y'all know I got that poster, boy. I had to do all that for y'all real quick. This is the comic book. Uh... For those who know, and probably know now, and I still got to show y'all some more, I'm a huge Weekend fan. I love his music. I feel like he just comes 
with the bangers. Uh, I don't care what people say that he's sad and all that stuff. That stuff is not true. Uh, it's it's uh, every chapter is a different character of his. Like literally, he's just uh, like a book. He's just a book, and he's a storyteller. Like he really talks about what he goes through and mixes it up and over exaggerates it. That's what everybody does. And if y'all be getting fooled by his characters and stuff, that's on y'all, bro. He's just like everybody else. I met him four times, three, two times at the Kiss Land tour. One time at the private event, he invited us. And then one time I flew out of California, me and Josh. Shout out to Josh Del Rio. Make sure if y'all need some specialty auto care, y'all go to his shop that's called Specialty Auto Care in Joliet. Firework for the low, low, low. But me and Josh flew out there with his uh, girl at the time. And I got given a VIP pass by this guy that was standing next to me. And he seen me vibing to the weekend. Uh, and he seen me outside. He gave me the VIP pass that he wanted at a radio station. And long story short story, I went inside, hollered at the weekend, talked to him for a minute. He thanked me for coming all the way out there. My boy ends up getting my pass to go in there, and he gets kicked out. He got kicked out the back of the club because they knew, like, oh, now they're passing the pass around. Man, I can go more in depth about that story, but I feel like I'll talk y'all ears off. See, I did this yesterday, but I didn't do it like this, and I was talking y'all ears off. I'm going to keep it short, fast. So y'all can just see the collections and we go from there. But I'm working because now I got to put all this back. Y'all see it here. Let me get some nice shots. I can get some nice snippets. Uh, you get what I'm saying? Oh, let me show y'all this too. These are all the VIP passes. Oh, don't forget about NAV. I go see NAV too. VIP, 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 VIP. You get what I'm saying? Your boy was a wrestler too, y'all. Don't get it twisted. Yeah, I was getting them big, big emblems. Yes, sir. Um, my sixth grade year, I won most valuable play, most valuable player uh, in wrestling. Let me show y'all how my guy looked. So, out of the seventh and eighth graders, I got the most valuable player because I was working my butt off. Anytime y'all put me somewhere, I get competitive. I want to be number one, <clears throat> and I've been like that since a shorty, guys. But I'm going to go ahead and mix this up with another view of the collection, guys. Y'all think it's over. Y'all think I'm playing, man. I'm the biggest XO fan out here. Biggest. Watch this. First, with my OKC, though, because I wanted to show y'all. Remember I told y'all I was showing y'all the hats? I want to show y'all some OKC. This is the OKC jacket right here. Lovely. Another OKC jacket right here. But now I'm going to go ahead and put these right here. And we're going to show y'all nothing but XO, y'all. One, two, three, four. I've never even done this before. Five, all XO stuff. Six, seven, whoo, fire. That's when they hit five years for Echoes of Silence. Eight, nine. 10. This is when he matched it with uh, TikTok. 11. Me and little bro got that. I got two of these things. What the heck? Times two. What the fuck you talking about? Another one. What's that? 11, 12, 13, 14. And then here go the hoodies, y'all. This is a nasty exclusive hoodie. And then we got another one right here. The olive green. I love this hoodie right here. It's so nice. So we got to go here. Now we got the TikTok experience hoodie again. Another hoodie. XO. XO. And then we got another one. XO. Y'all see it? XO again. Let's see. Look, now we got to start bringing these over here. XO. 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 Y'all gonna get tired of this. XO. XO. Till we overdose. If y'all don't know what XO2, TWOD means, that means XO till we overdose. And that's a big fact. Another raw hoodie. XO. Hold on. Is this XO? Oh my gosh. Wait. Is this XO2? Another XO. Beauty Behind the Madness XO hoodie. Another XO. Till we overdose, as y'all can see. Look, what's that say in the back? What's that say in the back? Till 
We overdose. Okay. That's what I thought. Another XO. This one I messed up really bad. Y'all watched it and it's all gone. Got my XO hoodie. Y'all know. I mean XO. My OKC jersey with Westbrook in the back. Another Westbrook exclusive. Why not? I'm going to show y'all more about why not in a bit. Another why not hoodie. Timberland hoodie. Another Timberland hoodie. And another Timberland hoodie. Look, y'all. This is it right here. But I'm going to all this stuff back. Do not leave. I'm going to show y'all my last collection, guys. <coughs> last collection. It's going to be the shoes. I'm just going to tell y'all right now. It's going to be the shoes. It's going to be. Let me show y'all some of that million dollar writer stuff. You get what I'm saying? 2018, 2017, and 2016, I got a 900K. And then y'all know since I've done a million. They don't take us. Uh, they don't give us trophies no more because we work for a new company called DSG. We got bought out. But we still work for Ashley Furniture. When they give it to us like this. Million dollar writer, Martin Sparta. They spell my name wrong. They spell awesome. They extremely petty for that. Extremely petty for that. They were supposed to give me a new one. They never did. But million dollar writer stuff, that's easy for me. I hit a million dollars every year at Ashley Furniture. I got the clientele for it. When you treat people good, they keep coming back to you. When you give them a good deal, they keep coming back to you. Sometimes my manager says, you take money out of your pocket. I might be, but those people keep coming back and they keep putting money in my pocket every year. So they tell their friends and family about me and we keep moving forward. I forgot to XO playing cars too plastic never gonna take those out a lot of this stuff is gonna be antiques in the future y'all know what it's gonna be worth you get what i'm saying but i'm gonna be bad guys i'm gonna be showing y'all the shoe collection in three two one all right guys on to the grand finale grand finale guys before we get to the shoes go ahead and show y'all the color coordination oh don't forget about the George V's I ain't wear yet. Oh my gosh. Yeah, don't forget about the George V's I ain't wear yet. I like these George V's. But, yeah, I got a lot of stuff, man. I got way more dress clothes than that. That's my little jackets there. Pants there. Some dress pants. And then collar shirt. I got way more than that. I just got to wash it. I ain't going to show you all the clothes I got to wash. I got a lot of clothes to wash. We're going to start... With the first pair of Kohans I ever bought. These were awesome when I got them. I still love them. Second pair, third pair, fourth pair, fifth pair of Kohans I got. So I got some nice little Kohans. Got me my leather boot, my leather uh, shoes that I don't wear. And I got the suede suede. These are the suede suede. Just got those, my newest pair. Got the pure monies. Pure money. All right. 13s, Hirachis, Hirachis, all YG Fazos, and the all YG Fazos with the burgundy to match the car seats. Tim's on deck. Remember them Tim hoodies I showed y'all? It's because I got Tim's on deck and I got the all white Tim's too. Don't get it twisted. All white things. Got the ones on deck. My brother, uh, Devion, gave me this. Good shout out, Devion. He gave me those for my B day. Got the mids right there. Got the Air Maxes on deck. Don't get the Air Maxes twisted now. Yes, yeah, sir. All black. All white again. You know you need two pairs of all white G Fazos. Got given these got given to me. Those are decent. Those are decent. And then these are the why not. Remember I showed y'all that why not hoodie? Why not? Why not? Why not? And why not? These are all Westbrook shoes. Those are the shoes guys i don't collect shoes no more i used to have a bunch of jordans people that know me from back in the day but those are the shoes gotta give me a nice little thumbnail i gotta take a picture of this later but i had to put all the shoes back now on the racks all that good stuff guys i worked really hard for y'all today i did this last night but i did it kind of worse so i did a way better job man i'm tired guys look look i had to turn my massage Right here, y'all see that? Gotta turn the massage on so I can relax a little bit. And then bring the feet up. Bring the feet up real quick. Let's bring the feet up. Look, it's coming up now. Oh, don't forget the exo sandals. Don't forget about the exos. I got where I can tilt just the neck. 
into the lumbar, which is the uh, bottom half of our back. Head, feet, different things. Look. Whew. Ooh, it feels good to relax my neck right here, y'all. It's been a long one, guys. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Uh, I'm about to watch that new episode of Power uh, that came out this past Sunday. I haven't watched it yet. That's how I'm going to end my night, guys. I truly, truly appreciate y'all, man. Tell me what y'all think about the collections. I pretty much showed y'all everything. I showed y'all my whole closet. I showed y'all everything, really, that's in my room. I just had to bring some content, man, and I wanted to come hard. And I hope y'all enjoy it. Make sure y'all share it with people. If y'all know anybody that's a big XO fan, share the video with them. Be like, man, look at this dude. Yeah, I think I'm better. I'm the biggest XO fan. Tell me if not. Shout out to my big brother, Pete, man. He's in uh, Denver right now. Shout out to Celine. Shout out to Ryan. Shout out to Devin, his wife, and his two daughters. Amazing human beings, guys. Been knowing Pete since forever. He's one of my biggest supporters. You guys will see him in the comments called Drive By P. Man, that dude is amazing. Shout out to my big bro, Rick. He's the one that put all of us on with XO. He used to work at Oxbow Muffers. I don't know if he still is. I'm going to have to text him. I'm going to send him this video for sure. Shout out to you, bro. We would have never been XO without you. And I don't know if y'all know, but my big bro, Devion. Whoever knows me knows Devion. Devion actually got tatted, uh, XO tat on his neck. My, other, my big bro, Pete, got XO tat on his head, bro. I have videos of it. Go to the very bottom of my YouTube videos and find the XO tat videos. I got Pete getting his XO tat, and I got my boy Devion doing XO tat. I recorded it personally. Guys, I was already recording YouTube when I was like 14 years old all the way to 19. I've been doing this. Like I said in the very, very first video when I started YouTube and I have not missed on dropping one. I am just back. I'm wiser. I'm older. And I'm more bored. I mean, you know, a kid is single, man. Look, tell y'all single ladies, man, that the kid is looking for a woman. I'm not even lying, man. I need to settle down. It's time for me to relax. Man, I be out too much. I need a massage or something every night, man. For real. I need some type of massage. I'm trying to go out to a steakhouse with somebody or something. Some type of relaxing. See, right now I'm about to watch Power About It myself. I'm about to cry and stuff, be all sad. No, I'm just playing. I love being alone, guys. Never be afraid to be alone. It's one of the best things. It's how you find yourself. It's how you become the real you. See, we be too worried about being with somebody, doing this, and we can't be alone. That's a lie, guys. That's how you figure out who you are. Right now... We doing the mattress talk, guys. I think I was telling y'all earlier that, oh no, I'm not even gonna post that video. I did a video in the gallery uh, at my job today showing y'all the Therapeutics. I'm gonna do that another time. I'm gonna say that for another time. I'm on a Therapeutic right now. I'm on a power base right now. It's the best sleep you can ever get. If you didn't know, the best way to sleep is on your back. If you have questions, comment below and tell me why do I need to sleep on my back? And I would tell you exactly why. And you gotta then come see me in person after. But, guys, I am going to check out, man. I truly appreciate you guys. You guys are amazing. I literally did this for my people that support me and people that watch me every day. Y'all are the real ones. Listen, on my channel, I might over-exaggerate on the title sometimes, guys. But I did warn y'all before that I'm going to cap a little bit. But a lot of it is real, though, guys. And I'm going to say it one more time. I'm going to say it one more time. I believe I'm 60 40 or 70 30. 70 real, 30 fake, 60 real, 40 fake. I don't care what y'all say. If y'all think y'all 80 20 or 90 10 or 100% real, let me know. Let me know. I'm going to accept it and say I need to get like you. Because it's really hard, guys, for a human being to be 100% real. That is called being perfect. And nobody is perfect except for you. You're my little brother named Perfecto Esparza. Y'all watched my videos before. Y'all would have seen my brother. His real name is Perfecto Esparza. He's named after our late grandpa uh, who passed away two years ago. Rest in peace to our grandpa. But shout out to my whole family. Shout out to Aiden. It's your boy Aiden. Make sure y'all watch this video, man. I want them views to go up on that so I can show them. Like, look, at, look at what you did, right? Shout out to my uh, Princess Camila. Shout out to my little brother, Sebastian. Shout out to my two beautiful sisters, Marcella and Orieta. Orieta, a.k.a. Tita. Marcella, a.k.a. Mari. Right, and then uh, my little brother perfecto, aka name is Tito, and then my mom can't figure out my mom, guys. I love my mom, Orieta Ortega, she's the most amazing thing that could ever be in my life, and I'm gonna always cherish her 
whatever she needs, I got her. Shout out to my stepdad, Jose. That guy, I just texted my brother this the other day. He is a man we can, me and him can both learn from. Like, literally a great man. Uh, if he can handle my mom, pff, that means everything already. He literally can handle my mom. My mom loves him. He loves her. They are amazing couple. Shout out to my pops in Oklahoma, Juan Esparza. He always says, I'm number Juan. <laughs> I'm number Juan, which means he's number one. And that's true. My dad is number one. He works hard for where he's at. He deserves to live however he wants to live. And, guys, like I said, I'm going to watch this last episode of Power. I don't know if I'm going to bring y'all with me or not, but I really, really appreciate y'all. And um, I almost want to say I love y'all, man, because if y'all watching me every day and supporting me every day, it's truly a blessing, and I truly appreciate it, and I love doing this YouTube stuff. And no matter what, I'm going to be dropping every day, every day. So even if you miss one or two or three or four videos in a row, you'll see the fifth, you'll see the sixth. Show your boy some love, man. Press that like. Press that comment section so you can press, put a comment in there. Press the uh, bell on the button next to subscribe to turn on all post notifications. Excuse me. Also, just press subscribe, guys. Help the kid out. I'm trying to get to 1,000 subscribers. I'm trying to get to 4,000 watch time. I'm very close to 1,000 subscribers. I'm very far from watch time. I'm at like 13% in watch time. I need to get at 100%. I think I'm at like 560 hours or something like that. And I need to get to 4,000. Appreciate y'all, man. Really, really appreciate y'all. I'm always going to say that because I'm a really, really uh, kind guy. And I really appreciate people. I always show so much love. People say, you too nice. I don't care, man. I'm never going to change. I'm always going to be ME. And I'm always going to show y'all the life of ME. Stay tuned, guys. I don't know what I'm going to drop tomorrow or what videos I'm going to be doing tomorrow. I'm dropping this tomorrow, actually, on Thursday. But I don't know what videos I'm going to be doing tomorrow. I know I got to get my hair cut at 8 in the morning. 8 in the morning. Guys, appreciate y'all once again. Tell me what y'all think about my collections, man. What I show y'all? Six collections. Tell me what y'all think. Please share it with other people so that they can subscribe. If I did a horrible job, please comment that. If I did a great job, please comment that. Even if you put a fire emoji, that helps me. The algorithm is real, guys. I really, really need to hit the algorithm so I can get recommended. And then I can continue getting pushed. And I'm telling you guys, once I get monetized, I'm going to be doing some crazy stuff. But crazy good, though. See y'all later, man. Hope y'all have a good night. Well, good night for me. But if y'all watch this in the morning, good morning. If y'all see it in the afternoon, good afternoon. If y'all watch this at night, good night, man. I'm checking out, guys. Life of ME will be back tomorrow. See you next time. Oh, wait. See you tomorrow. See you, guys.